Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Happy right now. I've got two 30-inch monitors. Maybe you don't, and maybe you want another desktop, but you can't afford to buy another screen because maybe you're carrying around a laptop. Uh, well, have you considered getting a virtual desktop? Don't freak out. It's not really going to cost you any more money than you have, at least if you go by the free solutions that we've published. In the corresponding article for this video, it's linked in the uh, show notes below, or I guess the video's description. If you consider this a show, great. If you don't, the link is still there for you to click on. How to create multiple virtual desktops in Windows 7 for free. So, uh, would a virtual desktop help me here with, you know, two 30-inch screens? Uh, probably not as much. I'm guessing. Uh, I, I, I've never really used it in, in this scenario, but on, say, a notebook computer where I have a limited amount of screen real estate, I could get access to more things without having to close programs and minimize and move around. You can just switch between desktops with an insane degree of ease. You can do this in Mac OS X, you can do it in Linux as well, but for this article, we wanted to concentrate on our Windows audience because we know a lot of you out there Use Windows. Even if you don't like to admit it to other people, we know you still do. And that's cool. So uh, one option we found as far as multiple desktops or virtual desktops are concerned is an app called Desktops. It's not a very creative name, really, but it gets the job done. And if you don't like what Desktops has to offer, has to offer. Boy, I'm just... Let me get... If you don't like what desktops has to offer, you might try Virtua Win, which are, is our sec, our, <laughs> which is our second recommendation. Our third recommendation is Dexput. So, okay, before I mess up anything else in this video, take a look at the links that we've uh, collected for you, the software that's here for you to use. Clear as day. You can do this right now. Create multiple desktops, virtual desktops in Windows. If you didn't do this before, you know, this uh, may change the way that you use Windows. It may make it easier. Things that, uh, you know, are now opened up to you. These new desktops, for instance. Your productivity should increase, especially if you use them to their full advantage. Take a look at the link. If you like it, please feel free to share it, just like I'm about to do. I'm going to plus one it, just like Alex Piero, John McKinley, uh, Skylar Johnson, Stacey Ferris, and Brian Miner have done. And, uh, I, again, I, I hope you like it, too.